Hey everyone, just got a download from Spirit. Somebody just took the leap of faith, went on a new date. It went great, right? And then I think you went home and you felt completely floored. I don't think you got their number. Look at this, lovers. I don't think you got their number. You didn't get a kiss or something like that. Something happened that had you really in your feel super confused. Yeah, I, I heard the name Emily. You just got a date with somebody. And um, I had this download come in when I was about to really get ready to go to bed. And I was like, this is my imagination. Is this my imagination? And I was already tuning into your energy. So whoever you are, you just, I feel like you just went on the date. And Spirit is so proud of you that you did it, okay? Um, I heard Nate or Nathan, that could be important. Um, Nath Nathaniel, something like that. Um, you guys, like I'm really proud of you. The name Nick as well. Okay, wow. They're really proud, but you are a little bit too in your head about this, okay? Um, yeah. Spirit, can I know more about this download? <sighs> what would you like us to know, Holy Spirit, please, about this interest? You guys, I'm not kidding. Spirit was like so proud of you that you put yourself out there. They were really excited that you did so. Somebody asked you out. You said yes. And it, it looked like it went swimmingly. How did, how did it feel? How did it feel, please? Yeah, I'm nervous in your energy. Like, I'm super nervous. The devil. <sighs> there was definitely sparks flying. I do feel the sexual tension. I feel sexual tension here. Ace of Wands and the devil. Wow. That is like, woo, honey. I feel like there's a lot of, oh my God. I'm feeling it in my stomach, man. I feel like there was eye contact made. I'm seeing two people at dinner and it's just like the eye contact or like the, I don't know. I, what I just saw was somebody playing footsie. I don't think you played footsie, but spirit was showing me that it's like uh, this, this back and forth banter or this, it, it almost felt too good to be true. The magician. There's like it, 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 the chemistry between you. I feel with the magician. It's like the chemistry though. Holy spirit. Why, why does this viewer feel so scared? Five of pentacles. I think they didn't do something. You might have bumped heads when it came to like paying the bill or uh, it's like a tip. Okay. So, so I'm hearing like a typical date, right? Whatever happened, there was something abnormal about it. At the end, at the end of the date, there was something abnormal about it. I feel like this just happened to you guys. Like this date was yesterday or today for whoever, whenever you get this reading, it's a, it's a, it's a timeless reading, but your intuition was telling you something like, oh, I didn't, I'm not going to get their phone number or, oh, I'm not going to hear from them again. I'm not going to get a second date. And I feel it in my stomach. I feel like this overwhelming sense of like, oh, I fucked up. I fucked up. Why does my viewer think they screwed this up? The moon. There's something about it. You don't know. There's something about them. You don't know. There's something about this, this, um, It's like, it, it, it almost feels like to me, you had to read between the lines far more than you normally would on any given date. The sexual tension was there though. I mean, the sexual chemistry, it feels like, whew, that's something fierce, honey. But it looks like there's something you don't see. What is you don't see with the moon? The high priestess and the moon is giving this very, um, I have to read between the lines. I have to figure this out. I have to go home and read cards. I have to look at my crystal ball. Like I have to use a pendulum. I don't know what the fuck they were thinking. Ace of Pentacles. Why is the moon here? Four of Pentacles. You could tell they were holding back about something. It could have been their job, something they do for work. About money is what I'm getting. The fool. They held back. They, they, they wanted to take a, a bigger leap of faith towards a conversation about money or something tangible something yes nine of pentacles page of pentacles it's like how they make money or how, what they do for a living or something like that you could have maybe done this as well whatever it was there was an illusion somebody held back about discussing or disclosing information about like how they're going to pay or how how they how they work what, what they do for a living you might even be the high priestess with the moon here and the magician you might have been afraid that this person saw your work as the devil or something like that. Yeah. I heard toxic traits. Why, why toxic traits, right? Queen of Wands. That's the, that is literally the witch for me. 
Page of Swords. Okay, so here's the thing. You think they didn't give you a callback or an offer or something like a um, like their number. Yeah, Ace of Cups. Uh, yeah, because of like what you do for work. You might be a mystic or a, a shaman, a teacher, something like that. You know, you, I think you do something in the mystical arts. You don't get the high priestess, the witch, the magician, and the devil in the same spread <laughs> and the moon without having some sort of intuitive knowing. So I think that you guys were a little freaked that this person thought... What did they think about your gifts? I feel like you thought they thought more of it than they really do. How did my viewer think this person saw? Let's confirm the devil. How do they, how do you think they saw you? What you do for work? Page of Cups. I'm getting a, a hobby, a creative project, something like that. Like they think that you're not, you're not really serious about what you do or something like that, or it might just be taking off. Whatever it is, the Page of Cups is like a creative endeavor, but it's new. It, yeah, it's brand new, and it's like you, you don't make a ton of money on it right now, or it's like, yeah, the Ace of Pentacles, the Page. It's like it's new, Ace of Cups right under the High Priestess. Whatever it is, it's like you're dabbling or you're getting, you're getting good at it. You're, you might have expressed that you don't have like a lot of money or a lot to, to offer somebody. You have three Aces. How did I not see that? Confirm the Ace of Wands. Definitely sparks were flying, I see. Yeah, Mother of Pentacles. Can't make it up, guys. It has to do with your level of like um, um, money or stability. And then we have the Knight of Pentacles. So it's like something is taking off really slow in your business. And you might have thought that that person, whoever this was, thought something kind of negative about, about the, the date because of that. Let's see. Can I get a message from this? Can I get a message from this person, please, Spirit? You're more nervous than they are, I'm hearing. You're way more nervous. And look at this. I love your free spirit. I'm really getting a gypsy, hippie vibe here from you. They actually really like this. I think, you're, I think you need to chill out. That's what I think. I want to go to the next level. I, I, I said it. I was getting that somebody didn't know if they wanted to have a second date. The answer is yes. You will probably be hearing from them again. What did, they, what did you think of my viewer? Do you really want this? I think that when you started talking about this, whatever situation this is, like what you do for work or if it's a little taboo or something like that, look at this, forgive me here. It's like they didn't think that you wanted them to pry. They didn't think that you wanted them to um, investigate further. So they might have seemed cold and aloof is what I'm hearing. Look at that. We are magic. I, it's something about your magic or a level of... I'm getting more and more excited for a long-term commitment. Yeah, this person does like you, though. Guys, I'm having sex dreams about you. I told you the passion was there. Um, any other message? Give me more on that. That's juicy. I'm trying to manifest you. This person really does think that... Wow, we have deception. That you guys are um, compatible. It's, it's just a flirt. It's not anything serious just yet. They might even be manifesting dreams with you right now. Like you guys might be getting these astral dreams, uh, lucid dreams together right now. How did you feel about the dream with my, or about the, well, I didn't mean to say that. So they might've dreamt about you. Yeah, I'm getting with the moon. They've dreamt about you. How did you feel about that dream? You're the cutest thing ever. I fantasize about us. This is a very sexual connection. I mean, I, I, I definitely am feeling that. Um, with the Ace of Pentacles with the Fool, I think they really want to take things to the, to the next level, guys. But there's like this apprehension. Like, do you really want this? Why do you think that you, they don't want this? Death of the ego. You need, to, you need to really, like I said, you need to really chill out, guys. There's a lot of ego here. There's a lot of fear. And then we have your so damn sexy. So if this person, if it scares you at how, at how uh, physically attractive they found you or vice versa, you, you're really going to have to go through an ego death. It looks like, like you guys are probably already going through an ego death because I feel like this was a very high level connection and, and the date seemed to go really well. I mean, I, I'm feeling it flow on their end. It's your end, the viewer that I feel really, um, I don't know. I, 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 just, I, just, I, just, I just, I just feel nervous all of a sudden. Um, no, that's too many. I think that's actually it. I, I, I feel like this is so weird, but look at this heartbroken. It's weird to end it on this note, but I feel like that's how the date ended. 
like, uh, okay, bye. And like you shook hands or something. That's what it feels like to me. Like it doesn't feel like you guys, it's almost like there was so much tension, sexual tension or like chemistry and stuff. It's like, it's like if it fell flat, you're almost like, why, why did it fall flat? Actually, before I go, let's get some advice from spirit about this. What is, what do they need to know? Please spirit. Holy spirit. What is my viewer? Five of swords. You really need to get out of your head right now because I think that you're causing your own demise in this connection, to be honest. Hangman, eight of swords. You can't make it up. That's the fear card for me. It's like you really need to do some meditation with the hangman. I think you need to look at this from a different perspective. That's what the hangman does. You really got to see it like you are an angel. Okay, you, you are the high priestess, honey. Anybody would, would be stupid not to want you. Do you, know, you see what I'm saying? So I think there's this energy of like, I'm, I'm too scared. I'm too scared. I might have screwed this up. I don't think you did. Did they screw it up? Seven of cups. Did they screw it up? Empress. No, you didn't screw it up. You didn't screw it up. You're just in your head. The seven of cups is an illusion card. Like you need to get out of your head guys with the moon and the seven of cups on the table. Get out of your head. Lovers, Ace of, you can't make it up. I'm gonna leave it there. I'm gonna leave it there. This, look at this cheese, cheesy grin here. Um, there's something about a new start that will be coming in. This person is gonna offer you some sort of commitment, some sort of contact. You need to get out of your own head. They, this person really, really likes you. They just thought that something that is just taking off a little slow for you, they didn't want to approach it. They didn't wanna talk about that subject very much because they thought you were embarrassed about it or ashamed or something like that. Um, and they, they didn't really want to pry into it, okay? Um, so they might not have asked more questions. I'm sure they would have wanted to. Let's actually confirm that. Would they have wanted to? Night, yeah, yes, definitely. Queen of Wands. It's definitely something about being a magician or being some sort of witch or something like that. Um, I think this person actually really does like that stuff, actually. Um, they just didn't want to approach you about it. Look at this, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. You can't make it up. Because, guys, if you've ever been in your head, like, uh, confused about your own gifts... This person's reflecting that, mirroring that back to you. And I do think right now, when it comes to working on your gifts, on your whatever craft this is, you're not really in the nine of cups yet. You're not really fulfilled emotionally and financially yet in this. So they didn't really want to push that. Okay. But anyway, otherwise they would have done so. This person really does like you. So anyway, thank you spirit for that message. It was really cute. It was a great download. I'm glad I got to read for you guys. I love you so much. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.